It's the first plenary session in the House of Representatives as lawmakers return from the Easter break. The only motion considered has to do with communal clashes that affected nine wards in Wukari local government area in Taraba state. Also aware that in addition to the destruction of houses and infrastructure, including schools, health facilities, and even places of worship, several people have been killed in the inter in internecine feud between the two tribal groups. Informed that, as at the last count, not less than 10,000 people have fled their homes and their food stuff completely destroyed, and those rendering them as internet displayed persons. From the contributions that follow, Lawmakers are clearly concerned by the recurring crisis. The history of this hostility, which presumably is over land resource utilization, to me requires that we review the dispute resolution mechanism in addressing the Jukun thief conflict. I am aware some years back a commission of inquiry was set up to investigate the Thief and Jukun crisis. And I'm also aware that that commission of inquiry submitted a report. The question that one is bound to ask is whether the recommendations of that commission of inquiry we are implementing. The issue is just beyond Thief and Jukuns. A lot is happening all over. Even tourists now are being killed in Kajuru. The Kajuru thing started as a small thing. And now even international people who come, you know, to, uh, to enjoy themselves and imbue some of their hard-earned money here in Nigeria are not being scared. The motion is adopted and security agencies are urged to increase their presence in the affected communities till peace is restored. The lawmakers also encourage the Benue and Taraba state governments to intensify peace efforts in the area. Lanre Lassisi, Channel Television News.